This video will be useful for those users who do not want to lose their data on a flash drive and today you will learn how to block recording and deleting files from a USB flash drive in two different ways. In this case, access to files will be open, it will be possible to copy files from this flash drive, but it will be impossible to delete files from the flash drive or add files to the flash drive. All my actions will be in the Windows 11 operating system, for Windows 10 all actions will remain exactly the same. Method number 1. To prohibit writing to a USB flash drive, we do the following. Take an empty clean USB flash drive and insert it into the USB connector on a PC or laptop, after which it appears in Explorer. Then right-click on the flash drive that appears. In this window select, Format. The fact is that in the FAT32 file system the prohibition on writing and deleting will not work, and therefore it is necessary to select the NTFS file system here. We click, Start, the system gives a standard warning that formatting will destroy all data on the flash drive, OK. Formatting is complete, click, OK and close this window. Now you can start to prohibit writing to a USB flash drive, but first, let's upload something to it, since then it will be impossible to do this. Here I have prepared several files and simply drag them from the desktop to the USB flash drive. And so, the files I need are located on the flash drive, and now we right click on the flash drive, here we select, properties, and in this window we press, security. Here it should be like mine, everyone. Click, edit. Now go down the list a little lower, and from the column, allow the entry, rearrange the checkbox, to prohibit, then click, apply. The system warns that writing to the USB flash drive will be prohibited, click, yes. Usually, after that, the prohibition of writing to the flash drive is already enabled, but in some cases such an error warning may appear, and here we simply click, continue. Now let's try to delete one file. If we try to right click on the file, we will see that the delete item is in this list, I click on it, but the delete function does not work, and it is impossible to delete anything from this card. Let's try now to write something to a USB flash drive. As we can see, now writing to the flash drive is prohibited and a notification has appeared that there is no access to the target folder and permission to execute this command is required. And so, we have connected a ban on writing and deleting files from our flash drive, regardless of which computer it will be connected. To return the flash drive to its previous state and access the files, you need to open the properties of the flash drive again, then security, and here set the settings you need. You should know that you can only disable the recording function on the computer where this function was activated. Well, in conclusion of the first method, a brief description of how to remove write and delete protection from a flash drive if there is no access to the original computer on which we installed the protection. We can copy the necessary files to the computer, and then format the flash drive. Formatting will return all the properties of the flash drive to its original state, and after formatting, we will be able to do all operations on the flash drive without any problems. Method number two. If after the first method the USB card can be formatted, then method number 2 will not allow formatting the flash drive or SD card and this is the advantage of the second method over method number 1. Before setting write protection using method number 2, the USB card or flash drive can be formatted in any file system, and this is the second advantage of method number 2. Before setting a write ban, I place several files on the card. I close Explorer and now I will show you how to set write protection in the command prompt. You need to right click on the start button and select terminal as administrator. For ease of use, I have placed the necessary commands in a text document, you can find these commands in the description of my video and then you can simply repeat my steps. I copy the first command. Then right click on the command prompt and press enter. I will do the same for all other commands. And press enter. 
The second command opened a list of all drives connected to my computer on the command prompt, and this is how we find out what number the system assigned to my SD card, this is number 3. You need to add a number to the third command that the system assigned to your card, and press, enter. And press, enter. With the fourth command we see that my card is not write protected. The fifth command has set write protection, and now we can exit the disk part program and close the command prompt. And press, enter. Let's check the result of my actions. To do this, I open the memory card and try to drag the folder with files to the SD card, but the write protection does not allow this. If we try to right-click on the file, we can see that the delete item is not in this list, and it is impossible to delete anything from this card. Now I will try to format this disk. As a result, we will see a system message that this disk is write protected. Write protection is set and I hope everything went well for you too. How to remove write protection on any flash drive or SD card. Now I will show you how you can disable write protection in the command prompt. You need to right click on the start button and select terminal as administrator. For ease of use, I again placed the necessary commands in a text document. You can also find these commands in the description of my video so that you can then simply repeat my steps. I copy the first command then right-click on the command prompt, and press, Enter. I will do the same for all other commands. And press, Enter. The second command opened a list of all drives connected to my computer on the command prompt, and this is how we find out what number the system assigned to my SD card, this is number 3. You need to add a number to the third command that the system assigned to your card, and press, Enter. And press, Enter. Using the fourth command, we see that my card is write protected. And press, Enter. The fifth command removed the write protection. And now we can exit the disk part program and close the command prompt. Let's check the result of my actions. To do this, I open the memory card and drag the folder with files onto the SD card, there is no longer any write protection. I right click on a text file. And now the delete option appears in the list, I click on it and the file is deleted without any problems. All that remains is to check if I can format this memory card. Yes, the formatting went smoothly and this command prompt method worked fine. This concludes my video review and I hope what I just said could help you and if you found it helpful please share my video with someone. Thank you very much for watching my video. Good luck.